Hello friends and welcome to my channel the Unix Mantra. Today we are going to learn how to move or carve a VAT directory to a different LVM partition. I assume that you already have a knowledge of volume group and LVM. So let's start. So this is my machine uh, which has host name as node1.thenixmantra.com and it has OS installed as CentOS Linux 7.4. Currently, it has a default partitioning scheme that is automatic partitioning scheme wherein it only has a slash partition and no other partition. So what we are going to do, we are going to separate the slash var directory to a different LVM partitions. So for that, I have attached a new disk to create a physical volume. So yes. Check. So slash jo slash hdb is the disk with size 10 GB that we are going to use to create a LVM. So let's create a volume group first with name VGVAR the disk name. Now create a LV. So VGVAR and we we'll give the name to the LVM as LVVAR. So actually, uh, I already had a volume group created on this disk, so that's why it is asking whether you want to wipe it or not. So just wipe it. Now the new LVM has been created. We'll format it with the XFS file system VGVAR and LVVAR so what we are going to do we will create a new directory and mount that particular LVM to that directory so I will just create a directory slash test and I will mount the newly created LV to this test directory then what i will do i will copy all the content from the slash var directory to slash test mount one so rsync when ax p slash one star two slash test So it is copying all the content from slash var to slash test and as you can see it has copied everything to slash test. Now what I will do I will unmount this slash test partition and I will just make permanent entry into the slash etc slash with slash wire partition file system as xfs and I will simply reboot this The reboot has completed. We'll just restart the session and log in with root. And as you can see here, the new slash var partition has been created. So this is how we can move a directory slash var to a new LVM partition. Thank you for watching the video.